Sure, Ruth's Chris Steakhouse and Capital Grill are both known for top-notch food and service, but we took a deep dive to figure out what sets the two classic steakhouses apart. While Ruth's Chris Steakhouse and Capital Grill are both upscale steakhouse chains, they possess very distinct atmospheres. Ruth's Chris is known for its warm and inviting ambience, though no two Ruth's Chris outlets are the same, with each one drawing on the local heritage of its specific location. That being said, many of the restaurants feature dark wood accents, plush leather seating, and subdued lighting, creating an intimate and cozy dining experience. This isn't always the case, however. Some locations are more chic, with modern takes on crystal chandeliers and contemporary art. Ruth's Chris, Ruth's Chris's, Ruth's, I don't know where to put the apostrophe. In contrast, the Capitol Grill offers a more elegant, metropolitan vibe, offering a more formal dining experience. Sophisticated and contemporary, Capitol Grill prides itself on an atmosphere that's stylish, but not at the expense of comfort and warmth. Among the restaurant's design features are Art Deco chandeliers and mahogany paneling, and some Capitol Grill locations feature unique architectural highlights. Notable examples include the historic, equitable building's bank vault-turned-dining room on NYC's Wall Street, and the Las Vegas location with its floor-to-ceiling windows overlooking the Strip. What makes steakhouses so awesome is their extensive selection of beef cuts, each offering a distinct taste and texture. Going beyond the typical sirloin and filet mignon, the variety ensures that there's a perfect cut for every carnivore. Chef! Yes? What does steak mean? Ruth's Chris offers plenty of steak options, from the rich marbling and buttery flavor of the ribeye to the T-bone, which features both strip steak and a tenderloin. Each cut offers a unique culinary journey. Some of the chain's other steaks include the bone-in cowboy ribeye, the New York strip, and an impressive 40-ounce porterhouse for two. Ruth's Chris also serves two specialty cuts, a butter-soft bone-in filet and a 40-ounce marbled tomahawk ribeye. While not as extensive, Capitol Grill's selection is still impressive. The chain's bone-in New York strip is a classic choice, but for those who prefer a more marbled cut, there's the bone-in ribeye. The steakhouse also offers a chef's suggestion section featuring gourmet twists on classic cuts. Capitol Grill states that they buy, quote, the very best that's produced, but isn't very open about where they source their beef. They also claim to be one of the only dining establishments in the U.S. that offers beef that's dry-aged in-house. The chain dry-ages its meat in temperature and humidity-controlled compartments. This process takes between 18 and 24 days, in which time the beef attains better texture and flavor. The beef is also cut in-house. And what that does to the steak is it tenderizes the beef and it adds flavor to the steak. It's just the best scent to cut steaks that you can get. Capital Grill steaks are prepared in custom-built infrared broilers to ensure that each cut is crispy on the outside and succulent on the inside. The Capital Grill's chef executive partner, Mark Gruverman, told Fort Lauderdale Magazine that there's more to the process than just placing the meat in the broiler, saying, We really season the steak and place it on the hottest part of the grill. The high heat results in a crust, which allows all of the flavors and juices to be locked in. Gruverman recommends the porcini rubbed bone-in ribeye with 15-year-aged balsamic, saying, The earthy flavor from the porcini porcini rub is balanced perfectly against the sweetness and acidity of the aged balsamic. Preparing steak is a fine art. It requires a blend of knowledge, skill, and the right equipment. Ruth's Chris has mastered this delicate balance, beginning with their careful selection of the finest cuts of USDA prime beef. The USDA prime designation represents the top tier of beef, known for its rich marbling and tenderness. To lock in that delicious beefy flavor, the chain uses a high temperature broiling method, finishing their steaks at 1800 degrees Fahrenheit. The intense heat sears the outside of the steak, creating a crispy crust while sealing in the juices, keeping the inside of the steak more moist and tender. Perhaps the only thing as unforgettable as the taste of a Ruth's Chris steak is the sound of a Ruth's Chris steak. Each steak is delivered to the table sizzling on a 500-degree Fahrenheit plate to ensure that it remains at exactly the right temperature throughout the meal. Additionally, each steak is topped with a dollop of butter and chopped parsley. The Capitol Grill boasts an impressive wine list that features over 350 options, encompassing a range of rare bottles from various wine regions across the globe. In fact, the list includes selections from most wine-growing regions, including Old World wines from Europe and New World wines from countries such as Australia, Argentina, South Africa, and Chile. Capitol Grill guests who don't want to commit to a full bottle can still enjoy a glass or two of the chain's pours thanks to Coravin pouring technology. This method allows for six-ounce wine servings without removing the cork, which preserves the integrity of the wine. Ruth's Chris offers a selection of wines that complement the restaurant's menu. While substantial, the chain's wine collection is smaller than that of Capitol Grill. Ruth's Chris offers more than 30 wines by the glass and over 20 wines by the bottle, showcasing a variety of both domestic and international pours. 
Both Ruth's Chris and Capitol Grill offer a variety of seafood options, but only the former serves as seafood tower. The chilled seafood tower comes with Maine lobster, colossal lump crab meat, and jumbo shrimp. The Capitol Grill equivalent is the Grand Plateau, featuring North Atlantic lobster, jumbo lump crab, oysters on the half shell, and a shrimp cocktail. Another similar but slightly smaller appetizer is the cold shellfish platter with a pound of chilled lobster, oysters on the half shell, and a shrimp cocktail. The chilled seafood tower at Ruth's Chris has received rave reviews from diners. One satisfied patron says that the chain nailed it, adding, OMG, when it came out, my jaw dropped. I was impressed by the display of food towering to eye level. Absolutely incredible. Another diner commented on the generous portion, writing, we had the seafood tower for two, and it was really made for four or more. So much food. Ruth's Chris emphasizes a traditional, homey feel that's perfect for those seeking a comfortable and leisurely dining experience. In contrast, Capitol Grill tends to appeal more to those looking for a sleek, high-end environment, making it the perfect setting for business dinners or adult-only special occasions. Both restaurants have a dress code that prohibits athletic wear and excessively revealing clothing. Ruth's Chris has a special menu for children under 12. The little ones can select between entrees like grilled salmon, filet medallion, hamburger, and chicken fingers. Each main dish comes with either broccoli or french fries, and a choice of dessert, but only if they're well behaved. You rotten kids, you should be locked in cages! While children are welcome at the Capitol Grill, there's no catering to their culinary preferences. A TripAdvisor user explained, The Capitol Grill is a high-end dining establishment, and whilst I'm sure the management would welcome children, my own view would be that it would be inappropriate for children under 10 years of age. When it comes to chains, signature dishes often embody a restaurant's culinary style, helping to define and reinforce its overall image and appeal. A well-chosen signature dish can become synonymous with a restaurant, elevating it above its competitors and attracting repeat business. So it's not surprising that both restaurants offer their versions of the signature steakhouse experience. The Capitol Grill's menu features chef's suggestions that highlight its dry-aged steaks. These menu items combine high-quality beef with imaginative culinary twists. For instance, diners can select from options such as the Kona crusted dry aged bone in New York strip with shallot butter. Meanwhile, Ruth's Chris has its signature steaks and chops. This menu section lets diners select from classic offerings such as New York strip, lamb chops, and tornadoes and shrimp. Nothing rounds off a sumptuous dining experience like a decadent dessert. Serving as the final touch to a meal, dessert leaves a lasting impression that shapes the final perception of a restaurant. On the other hand, for a restaurant, desserts offer an opportunity to showcase creativity and flair that distinguishes this business from its competition. And then we have a chocolate chocolate cake that's infused with chocolate, served with chocolate ice cream and a molten chocolate topping. While chain restaurant menus can vary depending on location, it appears that, overall, Ruth's Chris boasts a more expansive dessert selection than Capitol Grill. Some of the sweet treats on Ruth's Chris dessert menu are classics like creme brulee, cheesecake, and warm apple crumb tart, but the menu also includes more innovative dishes, such as the chain's rendition of traditional bread pudding infused with whiskey sauce. While Capitol Grill's dessert options are more limited, they are just as appealing. The menu features timeless favorites, such as the classic creme brulee and cheesecake, and there are also more unusual options, like the flourless chocolate espresso cake with fresh raspberries and the coconut cream pie with rum and caramel sauce. In formal dining settings, soup is often served as a first course of a meal. It acts as an appetizer, stimulating the appetite and preparing the palate for the dishes that follow. Soups can also be the centerpiece of a meal, particularly if they are hearty and packed with ingredients. Yeah, we both have so much in common. We both love soup. While Ruth's Chris and the Capitol Grill aren't known for their soup offerings, they are steakhouses after all. They do offer a small selection of soups, but if you're looking to add soup to your meal, you're better off dining at the Capitol Grill. Ruth's Chris only offers one soup on its menu, a creamy lobster bisque topped with chopped parsley. The restaurant also offers a rotating soup of the day. The Capitol Grill, on the other hand, serves a slightly broader selection of soups, from the comforting warmth of the clam chowder and the creamy indulgence of the lobster bisque to the cheesy French onion soup. Capitol Grill's soup menu caters to a variety of preferences and palates. While both Ruth's Chris and Capitol Grill are renowned for their high-quality steaks, they also serve a variety of seafood. One of the more unusual seafood options offered by both chains is lobster mac and cheese. While you can find the standard mac and cheese at many chain restaurants, you'll be hard-pressed to come across a version of the dish that rivals the decadence of what's served at these establishments. Capitol Grill's lobster mac and cheese stands out thanks to its lavish ingredients and exceptional execution. The shareable dish features Maine lobster and a blend of four cheeses. Those are definitely nice big lobster claw chunks of, of meat in there. 
The menu item seems to have impressed diners, with one satisfied reviewer describing it as to die for. Another online reviewer calls the dish the best ever, adding, It doesn't matter what else we order for dinners, as long as that is one of the sides. The lobster mac and cheese at Ruth's Chris has received mixed reviews from patrons. While some have enjoyed the dish, calling it phenomenal and even the best lobster mac and cheese they've ever tasted, other diners haven't been as impressed. The biggest complaint seems to be the dish's lack of lobster, with one reviewer saying, The lobster mac and cheese came in a huge plate, but I couldn't taste any of the lobster, just the macaroni. Ruth's Chris Steakhouse and the Capitol Grill share many similarities. Both establishments pride themselves on their prepared-to-order steaks. They both specialize in prime cuts of beef and utilize high-heat preparation methods that render them wonderfully crispy on the outside and tender and juicy on the inside. Additionally, both chains offer a range of seafood options, appetizers, sides, and desserts that complement their steak selection. While choosing between the two restaurants boils down to personal taste and preference, it's our opinion that Capitol Grill has the edge over Ruth's Chris Steakhouse. The Capitol Grill sets itself apart with a more contemporary and sophisticated dining atmosphere creating the perfect backdrop for a memorable dining experience. Moreover, the restaurant boasts a slightly more creative and diverse menu that includes unique dishes that may not be found at Ruth's Chris. In addition, wine enthusiasts might find the Capitol Grill more appealing due to its comprehensive wine list.